Hello, I'm Teacher Sharon. Today I will be reading Pete the Cat Goes Camping. Pete is excited to go camping. This is his first time. Don't forget your sleeping bag, said his dad. Or your hiking boots, mom says. The campsite is deep in the woods. Mom and dad set up the tent. Pete and Bob help collect sticks so they can make a fire later. Pete and Bob go for a hike. Bob shows Pete the footprints of different animals. Look at those footprints. Do you think we will see anything cool? Asks Pete. Hmm, maybe, says Bob. <laughs> Pete and his dad go fishing. They must be very quiet and very still to catch a fish. Fishing takes a long time. They finally catch some fish. Mom builds a fire. She cooks the fish for dinner and it tastes yummy. Next, Pete toasts marshmallows. Pete makes s'mores with chocolate and graham crackers. Have you ever had a s'more? They are yummy. It starts to get dark out. Bob tells Pete a story about a scary, hairy giant. The giant lives in the woods. His name is Bigfoot. Do you think Bigfoot lives here? Asks Pete. Think he's a little scared? No one has ever seen Bigfoot, says Bob. Don't let Bob scare you, says Dad. Bigfoot is not real, says Mom. Pete sighs with relief. But if he is real, I bet he's friendly, says Dad. And he likes s'mores, too. So guess what Pete did? That's not scary, thinks Pete. Maybe he wants a s'more. Pete leaves one for his hairy friend. He's leaving him a s'more. Soon it's time for bed. Lights out, Dad says, as he's pouring water on the fire. That's a good safety tip. Bob and Pete share a tent. Pete gets into his sleeping bag. It is cozy, but he cannot sleep. The woods seem extra dark, and all the sounds seem extra loud at night. Pete hears a weird swooshing sound. What is that, he asks Bob. That's just the wind, says Bob. Pete hears an odd chirping sound. What is that, that he asks out loud. Those are just crickets. Pete hears a strange hooting sound. What is that, he wonders? That's just an owl. Pete thinks of his friend, the owl. Pete hears a loud snapping sound, crack. What is that, he wonders, but Bob is already asleep. Pete listens carefully. Crack. Is it Bigfoot? Pete peeks outside. It's too dark to see anything. 
When Pete wakes up, he checks the spot where he left the s'more for Bigfoot. The s'more is gone. What do you think that means? And there is a note. It says, thanks for the treat. And it's got X and an O and an X and an O. I think that means hugs and kisses. Pete shows his family. Wow, I knew Bigfoot was real, says Bob. Pete knows Bigfoot is not scary. Just because he looks different does not mean he is scary. And he even likes s'mores. Good story. Bye-bye for now.